No matter how intimidating some of these large dogs may look, in general, larger dog breeds are usually loving, loyal, relaxed, and mild-tempered animals. This makes them excellent pets. Properly socialized and trained, large dogs can get along with all of your other pets, with the kids, and with all of the members of your family. The fact is, that being large animals, these dogs will most probably prefer to take naps all day long, as long as you provide them with the daily walks and exercise they need. Here are 10 of the largest dog breeds, which are all seriously big pups. The Irish Wolfhound The Irish Wolfhound is one of the highest dog breeds. The minimum stature of dogs from this breed is at least 34 inches, but their weight will rarely exceed 120 pounds for males and 105 pounds for females. The breed was developed for hunting wolves and for guarding. Irish Wolfhounds can have varied personalities, but are often quite individualistic and have their personal quirks. At the same time, they are not notorious for being aggressive or for acting impulsively. Irish Wolfhounds are generally quite gentle with children and are easy to train, but they are individualists which have been bred to hunt alone and far away from their owners. 9. Russian Black Terrier The Russian Black Terrier was created in the USSR before World War II and was used as a working military dog. It is a cross of 17 different dog breeds and is a brainy and highly trainable working dog. The height of the males can reach 30 inches at the shoulder, and their weight is up to 130 pounds. Their thick, coarse, waterproof double coats protect them from freezing temperatures, which makes dogs of this breed suitable for colder climates. Overall, the Russian Black Terrier is a very courageous, calm, and self-assured dog. It has a strong guarding instinct, which makes it an excellent watchdog. It is very protective of the children at home and gets along well with other smaller pets if they are raised together. 8. Leyenberger the Leyenberger is a crossbreed from St. Bernard's, Newfoundland's, and Pyrenean Mountain Dogs. As you can imagine, the size of these canines is quite impressive. Even though they were bred as companion dogs, they are great dogs for rescue work, herding, and swimming. The average height of the males is about 29.5 inches, while the females are usually about 27.5 inches. These dogs weigh about 140 to 150 pounds, they have a rather low life expectancy of just 7 years. But for its relatively short life, a dog from this breed will bring pure love and joy to your whole family. It will also attract a lot of attention when you go for a walk, so be prepared to be stopped by complete strangers who will want to pet it and take photos with it. 7. St. Bernard The St. Bernard was bred in the Swiss and Italian Alps for mountain rescue operations by the monks in the St. Bernard Hospice. They were used for clearing paths in the deep snow and human rescue operations in the very snowy and dangerous St. Bernard Passes connecting Switzerland and Italy. More than 2,000 people, including Napoleon's soldiers, were saved in the last 200 years by dogs from this amazing large dog breed. Dogs from this breed can reach up to 36 inches tall and can weigh up to 120 pounds. They are highly resistant to cold and are powerful dogs with a great sense of direction. St. Bernards are very friendly, gentle, and loving with children and with other pets. 6. Neapolitan Mastiff The Neapolitan Mastiff is not as colossal as the English Mastiff but is still a huge and popular dog breed. Its proportions can reach 130 to 155 pounds for males and up to 140 pounds for females. The height of an average Neapolitan male Mastiff is between 26 to 31 inches. Neapolitan Mastiffs are highly intelligent dogs that are very protective of their families and home, which makes them excellent guard dogs, but can pose problems if they are not socialized and trained right. They are not as reliable as alarms, as they tend to be discreet and prefer to sneak up on potential intruders rather than bark. These dogs are not appropriate for novice dog owners as they do need extensive socialization and training. 5. Scottish Deerhound the Scottish Deerhound is one of the most ancient hunting breeds in the world. It originated from Scotland, where it was used for red deer chasing and hunting. With its long, 
big bone legs and hound-like structure, this strong and large dog can easily reach its prey thanks to its amazing speed. These dogs are quite tall, with a height of up to 32 inches and a weight of up to 110 pounds Scottish Deerhounds look like Greyhounds but with coats. Their long tails hang to the ground, and they can have either black or blue noses. The coloring of the coat can be in various color combinations, and it is harsher and wiry on the legs and body and softer at the head, belly, and the chest. They are very good with kids but should be kept away from other animals, due to their strong hunting drives. 4. Commodore You may have seen this eye-catching mop-like large dog before. The Commodore was originally bred in Hungary and used for guarding property and livestock. Today the breed has been declared a national treasure in its home country. Dogs from this fascinating large breed can reach up to 31.5 inches and weigh up to 130 pounds they are not too suitable for apartment life, even though they are quiet and calm indoors. But it is in their nature to guard and roam outdoors, especially at night, so if you have a large backyard with a fence, you can get one of these dogs. Keep in mind that they do bark quite a lot and can be quite uncomfortable with strangers if not socialized and trained properly. Otherwise. Commodores are very loyal pets and are strongly devoted to all family members, and are especially patient with children and family pets. 3. Newfoundland Unlike many of the other large canine breeds, the Newfoundland was bred as a fisherman work dog, and not a guard dog. These huge adorable dogs were used to assist fishermen on boats and could haul lines and nets, as well as a jump in the water to save people or restore items that had fallen off the boat. The Newfoundland is an impressive, active water dog that can reach up to 200 pounds the largest dog from this breed reportedly weighed 260 pounds. Undoubtedly, the Newfies are among the best swimmers among canines. They are, in fact, still used in search and rescue water operations. They are highly intelligent and gentle natured dogs, which are usually black in color but can also be gray or brown. They look even bigger than they actually are thanks to their thick double coat which is meant to keep them safe and warm even in freezing waters. 2. English Mastiff The English Mastiff is the heaviest dog breed. The heaviest dog from this massive breed named Zorba weighed a massive 343 pounds. An average Mastiff can reach a height of 27 to 30 inches at the shoulder and a weight of 130 to 220 pounds. So, if you are looking for the biggest dog breed in terms of mass, then the definite winner is the English Mastiff. Being bred as a working dog for blood sports such as baiting bulls, bears, and even lions, the size and the mass of this dog are crucial for this purpose. It has a mellow, loyal, and even-tempered nature and is excellent for families with kids, who will enjoy playing with their gigantic friend. Mastiffs will require daily walks, and a lot of training and attention if you want the entire family to feel happy. 1. Caucasian Shepherd Dog the Caucasian Shepherd Dog was first bred in the Northern Caucasian area as a guardian dog. It reaches up to 30 inches at the shoulder and a weight of up to 130 pounds. It is a strong boned and muscular dog that is fierce, fearless, and self-confident whenever there is a threat. Otherwise, it is a loving, soft, and kind-mannered pet that can get along very well with the entire family as well as with other pets. Caucasian Shepherds have been used for centuries for protecting properties, livestock from predators, even from bears, and other duties. Today, they're mostly used as watchdogs or companions.